Patricia. We'll talk about some of the things that God said will happen on individual level. The first one makes me jump for joy. Because he said, erstwhile stubborn mountains we move. Mountains that have been stubborn before, we move this year. And he said, Many people will wake up to realize that their future is not in the hand of any government. And as a result, a lot of lost grounds will be reclaimed. I'm happy some of you are here today. Now you're already awake to that. Said people have been relying on one government or the other. You suddenly realize now, ah, my future is not in the hand of any government. It's between God and me now. So you begin to work hard and you say, a lot of lost grounds will be reclaimed. Third one, he said, also makes me quite happy. You know, the meaning of the word saboteur. A saboteur is somebody who is living with you, but is trying to destroy your plan. Uh -huh. He says, saboteurs will be disgraced. and displaced. So it will not only disgrace them, it will move them out of your, out of your life. Those are the three major ones that I can tell you as individuals. <sighs> As for Nigeria, I can only tell you two. Even the two, I have to look for the correct words to put them. The first one is said, significant Goliaths we fall. Significant Goliaths will fall. And then he said, before the end of the year, this year 2018, before the end of the year, there will be rays of hope. that all will still be well. On the international scene, quite a lot here. And if you have the prophecies of last year, go and check. You will see how everything came out accurately. On the international scene, he said, this year there will be less fire outbreaks. Yeah. 
but there will be more floods. Less fire, more floods. He said there will be misunderstandings among nations, but no major war. So those of you who are afraid of uh, a nuclear war, it's not going to happen. And then he asked me to tell you to pray against assassination attempts globally. The frightening word there is globally. It means all nations might be included. So we should pray against assassination attempts. He said there will be record-breaking temperatures, both high and low. Record-breaking temperatures, both high and low. He said there will be a handful of breakthroughs, both scientific and medical, this year. Handful of breakthroughs, both scientific and medical. Probably the most important thing he said about the world at large, which you should take to heart, is that the countdown to the end has started. So whether you believe it or not, the end is nearer than you think. The countdown to the end has started. Daddy spoke to me and said, uh, all this thing they are talking about, about climate change, this and that, that is merely an instrument in his hand to bring the end about. And all these people passing laws to allow people to live like in the days of Sodom and Gomorrah is just part of the instruments that will bring about the end. As for what he says concerning redeemed Christian Church of God, I can't say that from here. Your pastors will tell you later. Good. So, I'm ready to pray for you now. If you are ready for prayers, you will shout a big hallelujah. My Father, my God, I thank you on behalf of all these, your children. I thank you especially for those who are able to make it tonight. I thank you for those who are watching all over the world. You couldn't come because of distance. 
Father, when mountains begin to move, start with this, your children. The kind of faith that will move any mountain, my Father, my God, deposit in them in Jesus' name. All the grounds that these your children have lost, my Lord and my Savior, even before the middle of this year, let them recover all. And every saboteur living with them, every saboteur in their places of work, every saboteur in their churches before the end of January Father disgrace them all and displace them all Father bless the offerings of your children this year like never before the kind of blessing that will cause your children to say this is too much release unto them in Jesus name every one of you owing in a miraculous way God will pay your debt and you will never borrow again it shall be well with you. And this year, God will use you mightily for his glory. He will use you to raise the dead. He will use you to heal the sick. He will use you to set the captives free. And every member of your family shall be saved. It shall be well with you. And your joy shall overflow. This year will be the best year you have had thus far. So shall it be. In Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. Amen. Let somebody shout hallelujah. Now, take note of this very important announcement. This year you will suffer no when loss. I was waiting on the Lord. Tap TV, RCB by TV channel. The Lord told me that He will. I, don't, I want to say it in a way that uh, we will not be releasing any secret. Now, let's put it this way.